Sierra Lowry was very into sports in high school, volleyball, track and field, and cheerleading. But all that activity left her body aching. A routine physical exam pointed to the cause. Being told that I had scoliosis, I knew what it was, but not exactly the components, the degree of curvatures, treatment options. Lowry and her family decided surgery was the best option to treat the curvature and also prevent it from getting worse. So this is the low back, this is the upper back and she has two curves, similar sizes. And so that's what was treated operatively with a posterior spinal fusion. And that's what it looks like afterwards. So you see major correction of both curves. And so the spine is now straight. Since then, the now pre-dental college student has started blogging about her journey through recovery. One, two, three, step, push. Scoliosis affects as many as 9 million people in the U.S., about 2 to 3% of the population. Females are eight times more likely to progress to a curve that needs treatment. The primary age of onset is 10 to 15 years old, but it can develop as early as in the womb. It's absolutely amazing and fascinating. Arturo Ezbulak is a physicist by training. He and his team of researchers and students at the University of Cincinnati College of Medicine recently made what he's calling a paradigm shifting discovery. It has to do with a key component on how the spinal column is formed early on in life. The spinal column is composed of this nicely sliced or segmented vertebral discs. Using animals and computer generated models, they were able to mimic the process in which a mutation affects the vertebrae from being evenly divided and instead causing scoliosis. Then they were able to use drugs already available to correct that mutation. And maybe that will be a really secure way of doing this even maybe perhaps in the pregnancy, right? As Bulak admits, there's more to learn about the spine formation process. But he says there's been so much interest that it could lead to new treatments sooner rather than later. Things that we were thinking science fiction you know, 20 years ago are now doable. Meanwhile, Sierra and other young ladies Scripps News has profiled over the recent years with scoliosis want others to know life isn't defined by scars or differences. As many times as I've been knocked down, I literally keep getting back up because I believe in myself. Michelle London, Scripps News.